about to leave Already packing Come with me I'm not really asking We'll get away To a place where we don't know About to see The world in action What we can be Life with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited Alright guys, so I just got here to the office Time's up to new video, time for a new day, let's go. When the lights are out and you stumble in the dark You kept pushing on, but then you went too far When you shift- Alright guys, what's up YouTube? So, I'm here in the office right now, um, and I was kind of just taking a break, resting my brain from, um, coding because I finally finished a project, or kind of finished, but I got about 95% of it done with an, and it's a project that took me about two to three weeks to finish and so it's kind of my brain's kind of like done you know and I have another project I'm working on but because I've been working that for so long and it's done I kind of wanted to try to reset my brain before I work on another project as well so um, as I was like browsing the internet right now just re re kind of resetting my brain I found this crazy article check this out I want to show you guys really quick this is kind of crazy so this is on CNBC and I'll put the link in the description below but check it out it says Google Apple and 12 other companies that no longer require employees to have a college degree. That's insane, man. Okay, I honestly, I've been saying this for a very long time, but this makes so much sense. I wanna talk to you about this really quick. I'm gonna go to the back room real quick, but this is crazy, man. I've been saying this for such a long time, and to see an article like this on a big network like CNBC talk about it is honestly pretty huge. So let me go ahead and go through this, and we'll go back to the back, go to the back room over there, and we'll go ahead and talk about this. Shoot. So you live on um, Jesse drives two hours because he has all the bad freeways. So that's why I figured to be honest like for me time is more important than the money. I could study more code or do more stuff for a video. Alright guys so um, this is pretty much the end of the day now. Uh, I'm honestly, uh, something I gotta tell you guys is I've actually been sick all day. I've been trying to hide it. I've been, and I don't want to show it in any of my footages, even yesterday's video as well. And so I'm gonna try to do this really quick, which is why today's video is kind of shorter. But I want to go ahead and I want to talk about pretty much the article I just showed you. So I'll put the link in the description below, but I'll go ahead and read this for you guys right now. So I'm actually looking at the one on glassdoor.com. So here you go, I'm gonna go ahead and read it right now. So it says 15 more companies that no longer require a degree. Um, to work for them, which is kind of crazy, right? And, and it talks about here on Glassdoor, with college tuition soaring nationwide, many Americans don't have the time or money to earn a college degree, which is very true. Everyone is in so much debt. I know so many people who are in 50K, 60, 70K dollars in debt, and they don't even have a job that pays them enough to pay off that loan. There are so many people who have so much debt and they're only making 30, 40K a year, which is crazy. While even people like me don't even have a degree, who put in hard work on the side to learn a very valuable skill makes even more than them and I have no degree, no debt whatsoever. And so I'm glad that these companies, right, I'm very, it's exciting to see there are companies out there and I'm pretty sure they saw us a long time ago but they're finally officially making an announcement or something. But it's really exciting to see that these companies are no longer requiring degrees of work for them, especially for developers in general. And, and to be honest, like to be a coder again, again today, this alone proves you do not need a degree to become a developer in this industry. And I know there are people who put in so much time and effort to get in that degree, and that's amazing. And people like them are the reason we have, I guess you could say, Facebook. Although Mark Zuckerberg didn't even graduate, he did learn, I'm assuming, some stuff at college, right? And all these different companies. The, the foundation of Facebook are on people who know how to code who have degrees, right? But now, because there's so many resources out there, you do not need a degree to get in the industry today. And so let's read this really quick. With college tuition soaring nationwide, many Americans don't have the time or money to earn a college degree. However, that doesn't mean your job prospects are diminished. Increasingly, there are many companies offering well-paying jobs to those with non-traditional education or high school diploma, right? When you look at people who don't go to school and make their way in the world, those are exceptional human beings and we should do everything we can to find those people. And who said this? Google's former SVP of People Operations, Laszlo Block. 
right? I mean, these people want it that bad. They want it so much that even if they don't have a degree, they still make a way to make it. They still fight to survive in the world. Not even that, if you don't have a degree, what is it that comes out? And honestly, it could be things like pure talent, pure determination and hunger, right? To do well in whatever they do. Maggie, who is from Ernest & Young's magazine partner for talent said, Academic qualifications will still be taken into account, of course, and indeed remain an important consideration when assessing candidates, etc. But she said, as a whole, they will no longer act as a barrier to getting into the front door. Because as you can tell, if you're like me, someone two years ago when I was looking to apply jobs, they always looked for four degrees, four degrees, four degrees. But now, if you look nowadays, you don't see a degree as a requirement anymore. Um, Google and Hilton are just two of the champion companies who realize that book smarts don't necessarily equal strong work ethic grit and talent, whether you have a GD and are looking for a new opportunity or charting your own path beyond traditional for your college route, here are 15 companies that have said they do not require a college diploma, etc. for the top jobs. Which is amazing, right? And number one on here, which is a company everyone knows. I mean, look at this. Number one, Google doesn't require a degree. Penguin Random House, Costco Wholesale, Whole Foods, Hilton, and this is for the top jobs at those companies. Apple no longer requires it. Starbucks. Uh, Nordstrom, Home Depot, and, you know, IBM, look at that, right? Bank of America. And, and there are a bunch of more companies out there. Now, p companies are no longer looking for people with degrees. It's no longer a requirement. Why? It, it's because if you really want it that bad, if you're able to make it in this industry without a degree, doesn't that show how much more you're willing to work? How you're willing to do whatever it takes to get in the industry where for how long already? For the 20 years the internet has been around or however long the internet has been around, where people have needed a degree to build these things that are very complex. But now with all the resources we have online, you don't need to go to college to make it today. I know someone who was studying code, but after being in the industry as a developer for only two years, he's getting paid $130,000 a year and more, right? And, and it's crazy and it's only going to skyrocket. But why though? It's because he's, he's better than me, right? But the thing is though, he's the cream of the crop. He stood out, and what do I mean by this by standing out? He's not smarter than me. He's not better than me in any other way as a human being, but he put even more hard work. While I'm doing YouTube videos, right, and studying code on the side, he's just studying code like crazy, and he talks about code, and he, and he failed, and he makes mistakes, and people won't hire him, right? People have rejected him, but he didn't let that stop him. He kept going and going and going, and two years ago, he was earning nothing, and now he's making, earning a Silicon Valley salary where he lives, which is absolutely amazing for where he lives, too. And so I want to make this video short, but what I'm trying to say at the end of the day, that it's not about a degree, but it's about how much you want it, how you sell yourself, number two. Thirdly, the hard work you put in to learn code. Next but not least, like building a strong portfolio and even when you get rejected, and I guarantee you'll get rejected many, many times. Other than that, like you just keep going and you will get in it. And so I just wanted to make a short video for today for you guys to encourage you, man. I know I make a lot of these videos it's because this topic is very important to me, right? If I can do it, you can do it too. You don't need a degree. You just need hard work, grit, and pure determination to make it in the industry today. Anyway, I end the video here. Thank you guys for watching. If you want more stuff like this, let me know. This is Krishan, it's Life of a Developer, and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. I'm out. Peace.